Hi, it's Susie. Finally, Grant's here for a Christmas design. Candy cane. Oh, is that what we're doing? Yeah, I didn't even okay. tell you, did I? Okay, cool. That sounds good. I just said, just come and show up, and that's what you did. So he's here. He's up for anything. We're going to make candy canes with gel paint. Let's get started. So most candy canes, to my knowledge, are primarily white with red and green. And that's it. Stripes, right? Is there any or, other kind of candy Or cane? are they red with white and green stripes? Mm. It's, like okay. the, it's like the zebra thing, you know? They're like, are they black with white stripes? Or... <laughs> True. So we're going to start mainly with a white base then, and we're going to do one red then. Let's just throw that in there. Okay. This is live TV. Live TV. Live YouTube. Grant's nails are all prepared, ready to go, and I'm just going to put a thin coat of white. I'm going to put two coats of this white gel, curing it with 30 seconds in between as my base. I have a bad knee now. Did you know that? A bad knee? Grant. Yes. You're 23. You're not supposed to have this conversation of things that hurt until you're at least 40 or 50. Well, I have a bad knee. My left one's the bad one, so <laughs> I'll tell you that right now. You have a bad knee, yeah. please. That's a thin layer you got there. I'm trying to go really thin. Why are you trying to go thin? Is there a reason? Uh, gel is so easily wants to be thick. Uh huh. And it looks gross when there's really, really thick layers of polish. Oh, and it won't even cure, right? You won't even cure um, that well if it's too will... thick? Is yeah, that... you're right. It, it will. It can wrinkle. Mm. You can cause problems if it's too thick. I'm learning so much. You are. You should let me train you. Oh, that sounds like a disaster and a half. Could be. Could be fun. <laughs> 30 seconds. Put your little fingers a little bit together. Mm, okay, all right. Uh, I'm low-key living for your sweater here. You like me sweater? It's so, um... It's... Um, I know, it's borderline ugly. Oh, no, I've seen way worse sweaters. Well, that's I've a compliment. Seen, yeah, <laughs> isn't that nice? I know. That was uh, far more shady than I uh, intended that. It's, uh, I wore this sweater just for you and Cameron. I knew Cameron would hate it. I don't know that he hates it. Um, I don't think he his loves nose it. wrinkled pretty good when I put it on. Mm. I'm going to try this. Oh. Love is in my cards. Read by OPI. Ooh, ooh. That is a Christmas red. That man. is a deep red. <gasps> snowed here in Victoria last night. Were you happy about that, Grant? Nope. Nope. I was not. Nope. Have you seen the size of my driveway? <laughs> yes. That, that, mm. So then what happens when it snows enough? What? Who then gets to, to oh, plow the driveway? Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. I thought you were upset because you had to drive up it. but you just Well, to that it. too. I don't love it. But it's worth it. it. It hardly ever snows here in Victoria. So when it snows, I'm like in heaven. The cameraman, and now I've been devastated to find out you don't like it either. I don't like snow. I mean, it's okay for like one day in the year, but it's got to melt before I have to do any shoveling. Well, then, then that's then you don't really like snow then. If it has to melt, it so, looks pretty. You it like really it does. when it melts. Susie likes it because she doesn't have to shovel it. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. I've shoveled it many, See, many I think, times. See, I think that's that's the difference. Like, I know lots of people who absolutely love it when it snows. And I was like, oh, do you have to, like, <clears throat> ever drive in it? Do you have to ever plow I love anything? it. Clients cancel, and it's not good for business. Yeah, in Victoria, when it snows, like, the city shuts down. Yeah, it'll be like an inch, and they're like, oh, I can't do it. It's just, We're it's not hilarious. Very well <laughs> accommodating for snow. But it's beautiful. Well, it's, it's gorgeous when it falls. It is pretty. It. And I don't like it's it when magical. the power goes out, but when the power is out and the snow is falling and you're like walking in the middle of the street, hoping you don't get hit by a car, you're like, oh, <laughs> this is lovely. It's very dramatic. It's, it's peaceful. It is. It's lovely. I love it. So here is my gel paints. 
And I believe it's paint mixed with gel. The advantage of gel paints, I've always thought, why don't I just use paint? But with the gel paints, it never cures. So you can keep working with it and create your design. You know, take an air up. It doesn't, it doesn't cure on you, it doesn't harden. You know, sometimes paint has that little layer on there and you can't work with it anymore. This never dries until you nuke it. Now I should really take all this silver stuff off, but sometimes I feel like I should just leave it on. So I just sort of carve these little holes so I can expose it and just use it. That is absolutely in line with your personality and everything that I know about you. Is it? To just poke a hole in it and not take off <laughs> the entire silver film. It's probably That's stupid. That's good. Yeah. Okay. So I've got three brushes. I'm just going to try to decide which one I'm going to use here. I don't think that one. It's really up between these two. So what's your determining factor in which one to use? I don't know. Depends on whatever mood <laughs> <I'm> Okay. <in. laughs> Oh, it's just a really a matter Honestly, of... I think that's oh, what okay. I right. do. So he has names on them. Oh, they're both called Petite Macaroon. I don't know where he got that from, but that's kind of funny. <laughs> okay, so they're both, you can see, very long. And this one might make too wide, but let's let's try it. Okay, I'll try to hold it differently so you can all see. So maybe I'll finish this red one. Oh, that's a pretty good brush. Hmm. Yes, you do have to have a steady hand and a good grip on the client. But I will get a little cotton pad. They'd be better if they were lint free, but I'm gonna make it work. I'm just gonna spray this and I'm just going to clean it because I wanna use a different color. Just gonna clean the gel paint out of there. Let's use some silver. I've never used gel paints before. This is the very first time. Now, candy canes are kind of like different size stripes. Oh, you know the best candy canes are those blue ones. Oh, wow. Have you had some of those? Oh, man. No, I don't, I don't really like mint that much. Well, I, yeah, I don't really Unless like it's covered it. in chocolate. Fair. Anything covered in chocolate is better. Mm -hmm. um, regular candy canes are good, but like there's these blue ones. Oh, wow. Oh. Where do you get them? Uh, good question. I would never really get them. I would just see them at like school and stuff whenever I would, I don't know. I don't know where they get them, but they're good. Oh, loaded with more sugar. That looks so cute. Look at that. It's kinda. Okay, so let's do. Well done, nail tech. <laughs> nail career education. I like this brush. These are in my way. I have to move these. I'm trying to create here. I think what makes a candy cane too is the different size of the stripes. I guess they some are different are, sizes. Yeah, yeah, some are wider. You know, it's funny what you think you know in your head, and then if you get online and look up different candy canes, you'll see so many different types. Wow, that green's a lot lighter than I thought it would be. Cool. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, I have done this with gel polish. I've done this with the art paints out of a long skinny brush, and you should have paint them on. I've done it with just nail polish, and I've done it with acrylic paints, and it is so thick and clumpy. But this stuff leaves it still quite flat. I like that way better. I think I I like the silver. I'll just try to do a nice thin silver. I also find too um, the positioning of the stripe too helps indicate the different types of candy canes. Like this will make the red one quite a bit wider. It seems to. Oh yeah yeah yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, you know what? I'm gonna try that little thinner brush. Maybe, maybe. Let's see if it goes thinner. Get the red back over here. Hope you don't mind candy canes at work and stuff. Well, I'm gonna have to like them now. No, I'm sure it'll be fine. They don't get have a problem with the different colored nails that you have at work? No. Nope. That's a progressive company. No. See if you just do a little bit thinner. Oh yeah. If I think this is too thin, so I'm just gonna see if I can thicken it up a little bit. Try to make it a little more even. This is definitely hand painted stuff, eh? Oh, yes. I'm gonna do a silver one here. This is a unique design. Only me in this world has this right now. Oh, lucky you! I know. Seven billion, and I was the one. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna do this one because I'm gonna do something different. I'm gonna shake Ooh. things up. Ooh. One thing I'm noticing they don't run. So where I put it is where it stays. Yeah, it's not moving a whole lot once you apply it. No.
Okay, I'm gonna shake things up. That's kind of neat. Ooh. I'm, I'm messing oh. with the candy cane design. Saucy. I think I should clean it every time though. I've done these before, but if when you play with it too much, you just mess it up, and that's just should, should not happen. I like that. It's nice. Cute. Yeah, that is. It's a nice twist. Oh, I guess we could play with the pinky before I nuke ya. Oh, you know, there is this other design. You know those candies? It's like, like a pinwheel. Do you know those candies? Like a pinwheel? You and the candies. I, a I think pinwheel? I just, no. When you said pinwheel, I immediately thought of wagon wheels, and I was like, those are not candies. Those are... That was really close to my face. Sorry. <laughs> I just like, ah. didn't mean to punch you. Um, you know, I'll I'll just draw it. I thought once you told me that you like these. Pinwheels. Yeah, like a pinwheel shape. What are you drawing right now? What? That you're drawing a pinwheel? Yeah. Okay. I bet you the YouTube friends out there know what this is. There's Oof. a candy that looks like this. What Does is it that? somewhat look what? familiar? No. Okay. Maybe. Oh, 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 those oh, things. Oh. See, I'm they're, not crazy. Um, are, they, are they are they like yogurt? Well, they're not no, like. No, these are a hard candy. Yogurt. No. Okay. No. Okay. Okay. Back of the bus. Back of the bus. I misspoke. Some of them are actually yogurt infused though. But they're like, it's like a little tiny little candy, right? And then it's like the white and the red and yeah, yeah, and they're hard and yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, those are. Pretty I should have brought some. Those I have them in good. the shop. Those are really good. I thought you said you liked them Sorry. like years ago. I, I didn't know that. what they were called at all. And Neither do when I. When you just apparently. were drawing random red, I was like, okay, thanks for coming out, Susie. But I got it now. Is it usually green in them, though? I usually only just yep. see them. The ones red. I have at work have a little bit of green in them. I actually bought them for the shop because I have this beautiful ornate candy dish glass. <gasps> and I just put them in there. They look so pretty in the shop. Okay, nuke time. We just Christmasified you. Christmasified? Christmasified. Beautified. I do like the idea of cameraman. Uh, just, doing nails? Yes, absolutely. Not doing mine. I'll do cameraman's nails, okay? We're just gonna... You, uh, I'm gonna teach Grant how to do nails. You just let me know if you like that idea. I think that's what we should do. Mm. I'll get him set up. You'd make a great nail tech. Uh, huh. He's got the gift of the gap. The gift of the gap. You heard of that phrase before? Oh, clients would love to come to you. Oh, Lord. It You'd would. be such It'd a be cute little nail technician. So I'm going to top coat this now, and then we're going to cure it again and check out the reveal shots. Okay, I got outvoted. We're not going to reveal. The boys want me to finish the thumb. Um, we'll what should we call that? We'll call it's not... it smearing. Smearing. Smeary McSmear face. A little bit of a nuke. 30 seconds. 30, 29, 28. You got lost? Died. You know. Getting okay, tricky now. I don't, I don't, yeah, that's what, what comes after 28. That's <laughs> funny. That's kind of like another cat eye, I think. I don't like it. We are veering away from Christmas, gentlemen. Nah. Christmas is overrated, so we're done. <laughs> you have to cut that out. <laughs> he will not. But anyways. That is terrible. What are, what are you doing over here? You're okay. We're switching it up here. I am. I'm just. I like know. it. I think that looks that's kind of cool, actually. Not as great, just like that. But I'm gonna smear. Oh, okay. You. That's what, <laughs> that's that's what, you wanted. That's what we wanted. I got outvoted. I was gonna go to reveal, but y'all wanted to smear. Oh, I see what you're doing. Oh. stuff is great. I have to say, good job, Max. I love this stuff. 
Think of the pictures I could paint. I could actually paint pictures, you know. Paint pictures? Mm -hmm. Oh, you mean like an actual painting? Yeah. Like I oh, think. I didn't know you wanted to do an actual painting. Well, not on a nail. It's so tiny, although there are some artists that do. But this stuff would be really what I'm getting at, is this stuff would be really great to paint pictures with. It is very pigmented, so when you put it down, it's like there. Okay, that's going to pull. Okay. I don't like your smear. I don't like that. Sorry for suggesting something. That's neat, isn't it? Okay. Maybe we should call it intersecting gel. Intersecting gel. There's some sort of, we could give this a sciencey twist. Cameraman's all about science. Yes. We'll call this. And so are a lot of the viewers. I saw so many. Oh, there are and actually a lot of. Total oh, smart oh, okay. 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 Cameraman. That's... There were some great Schrodinger. Yeah. All that references. is. Yeah. I loved it. I was howling. I'm not really a science person, but Schrodinger's cat thing. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's pretty cool. You got to admit. I know you don't know that, but it's, it's pretty cool. Well, I've heard about this cat, but I yeah. prefer my fluffy ones in the it's, house than this Schrodinger's. It's neither dead nor alive. Yeah, that's just sad. I <laughs> yeah, my... yeah, don't even know what I'm saying right now. Okay, cool. Good talk. I'm glad we're doing these nails. This is great. Stop it. The thumb looks great. Can I just say that? The thumb looks You like fantastic. that? It's cool. Look at it. I think it's fantastic. But it's not Christmassy. It is Christmassy. It's red, white, and green. Deal with it. But there's no Christmas design in it. It's just Sure. Your Let's see it. Pull it back. Oh, I yeah. think that's Xmasy. You're ruining my oh, nuke yeah. time, boys. What's wrong with it? I'm it's trying got, to nuke. Nuke kinda, time here. It kind of has a... Like a it <laughs> yeah. looks like the bowels of a tree. Blowing in the, the bowels snow. of a tree? Oh, not bowels. 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 It's not a good word. Oh. Yes. <laughs> what? The bowels of a tree? What was the word you tried? Bows. Yeah, okay. Words. Okay. Okay. Got it. You. You. You are a wonderful nail tech. Look at you. You. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying? I just thought I'd comment. You take the compliment. <laughs> <laughs> this is not real. <laughs> This, this video is, is a mess. This really is. This, this video, video is a mess. This video needs to stop. Yeah. This is going to be hard to edit. Yeah, this really is. <laughs> Poor cameraman. Oh. Poor my YouTube friends have to be subjected to this nonsense. They'll love it. Even, I'm curious if they like this. Pretend. I'm not so sure. Or I you like think this. that thumb specifically? This was cameraman and Grant inspired. Oh, I think there is something it's, interesting there, but oh, it's, it's awesome. I'm not feeling it. It is. Right. It is. It's like, I see like a tree line. A Christmas trees with snow on them. And that's what I see. I think it's great. I don't really see anything. I just like it. I was going to say, I don't it's see not, anything in there. You're not seeing it from my angle. Every, all the viewers are seeing <laughs> it. Yeah, man's <laughs> angle! That's right. That, that's trees, man. You'll see. Where do you see the reveals? You'll see what I mean. Help me. Okay. All right. Here we go. Okay, let's wrap this up. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's time for reveals. Time for reveals. I gotta say, I don't know if I'm proud of this. This looks like a Christmas mess. I love it. I think this is good. Really? Yes. This is good. Particularly this. I I, I like this whole, um, I don't know. Well, it's fact. not what I really wanted, but I hope you like it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So convincing. I just, wow. I'm just not sure about this. Anyway. It's a little tacky, but hey, it goes good with your sweater. So I... <gasps> oh. <laughs> I think we better stop now. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Maybe they won't be here. Bye.